Hello everyone, welcome to Phasmophobia. Today, it's thunderstorming on Tanglewood, and we're heading out on Nightmare. So, we have reached Tanglewood once again on the cycle of maps. Like I said, I've been going through all the small maps on Nightmare to get started, and oh my god, there's just a bone right here in the middle. So it's been, it feels like it's actually been a little while since we've been back on Tanglewood. Okay, wait a minute here, yeah. Okay, we do have the breaker. But what about my favorite hiding spot? Oh my god, so... If the ghost isn't near here, we'll be fine. So, when it comes to Nightmare, I heard that. I'm starting to learn that I already know most stuff. And I'm actually having surprisingly... To me, at least, I'm having a large amount of success. Surprisingly. No, ah, Why do I even bother? What was thrown? Oh, it was this plate that was, like, in the window, so... Okay. I already wasted one of my deletes. Okay, I like having the ghost in this kitchen area, though. But I'm not sure what to expect from Nightmare. It's weird going back and forth. But Nightmare is fun, because now I'm truly learning all these ghosts. I don't know, you never really know. Like, sometimes Nightmare feels like it's gonna be hard. But then I get a ghost that, you know, it's like a phantom, or... Like the last one with the Yuri touching the door. So, I want to, like, just talk to this ghost. Christopher Todd. We don't have hard objectives, like hunt objectives. But, and, uh, again, in Nightmare, you pretty much need to get hunted. Come on, Christopher Todd. Well, that hiding spot's good enough, and it was already cold in there. So what about a potential other hiding spot? <laughs> now, I think this spot's still bugged, so I'm gonna not use that. At least I think it's bugged. Somehow I survived in there. But the only other spot, I don't even think Nightmare can have two spots. I think it's a very, it definitely should have two spots. Like it's a rare thing though, but I don't know. And then again, there's like no reason to go back here. I mean, you could hide, but I don't know. It's not worth it. Yeah, see, they blocked the hide behind the door so long ago. Okay, well looking through the house, what is, is that shoes there? I didn't even realize those were there. But we already have the bone. Oh, did we get the cursed item, or am I just, once again, not paying attention? Let's go head to the basement. No, there it is. <laughs> again, the summoning circle. Oh, look, see, there's, so, sometimes there's a second hiding spot. But I don't think it's a guaranteed thing, but there it is, all the way down in the basement again if we need to hide down here. I kind of want to turn that light on, but I think I'll be okay. Calling me again. Alright, I tried talking to the ghost. We got some photos. I'm going to drop my stuff and get some evidence in here. Okay, after visiting Sunny Meadows and Point Hope and stuff so much, and even the farmhouses, it is fun to come back to a house map like this, and especially Tanglewood, because I just got done saying how Tanglewood's like the best map in the game, pretty much. Look at this, this book is so good, it covers the whole damn house, pretty much. Oh my god, unless I'm not putting it down, down, which I don't think I even was. Although, you still can't really see the corner of that, so I'm gonna put it right here. Of course, you had to touch the door, and I don't have UV. Now, it's been cold and it's not freezing. What about EMF5, though? And it was this door. I don't think you're going down to the basement. Let's, oh, let's set this up right here. I like finding natural spots to set up cameras, so I'm gonna do it old school, and we're gonna go back to the truck to see if there are ghost orbs. I don't know, I just thought of that on a whim. I don't think I turned on any lights in here. Christopher, give us a sign. Okay. What was that from? I, do I take another random photo? I really probably shouldn't have. Oh god, what a, so much for getting lucky. Okay, that was a glass. Now you're touching the door again. Maybe I should just go back and look for the ghost orbs, but I'll take... Where is all this happening? It could be twins or something. I mean... Okay, is it riding twins? Hold on. No. But I can take a photo of that. Can I get two photos of that? This one's interaction, one's ghost riding. Okay, at least I'm getting some photos, but guess what? I've already screwed up two. But we have the bone, so maybe perfect game if I get two more and just don't screw them up. So maybe drop that so I don't get too anxious with it. But if it's still cold in here, it's just roaming out of its room. Okay, I think I'm gonna head back and get more stuff. 
Well, if you haven't knocked over my camera, I'd like to look for ghost orbs, but guess what I forgot and turn the light on. Okay, well then let's get dots. It might be hard to look for ghost orbs and dots at the same time. See, that's what sucks about this. I wanted to do this and then screwed it up. But okay, we'll get other stuff in there and we'll come back for this. Get that UV. And I don't know, I think sanity's fine. This ghost isn't being too crazy. I don't think it's draining my sanity, but maybe it is. Since I left the light on, I'm going to actually just throw this down. And throw that down. Maybe just scan these doors. And actually, I'll tell you what, let's go do what I wanted to do. No, wrong light switch. Turn these off, and then I'm going to go back and do this like we used to have to do. Alright, this is the proper way to look for ghost orbs. We actually get to scan the whole room, too. Wow, I, I love how this looks. I don't know if it's because of the tier 3 or if it's really just been this long. But I don't know, this looks like a really clean view. But it's been super cold in that kitchen. No ghost orbs. So then we'll go set up dots, <laughs> leave the light off, and start asking some questions on the spirit box. And I don't know. See what we can do about getting a perfect game. Alright, I really don't know why, but I'm bringing in all three of the instances. And one of them, one of the objectives is to smudge. So I'm going to, just to try and get more activity. So hopefully you're in here, although you've been kind of roamy, so maybe... I don't know, maybe I'll throw that downstairs. Oh no, you are in here. So I'm going to leave the lights off for extra spookiness. I'm going to put the dots on. I'm going to, I really want to keep the dots scanning in the room just for fun. So I'm going to let that scan the room. You're over there again. I only wish you were in this room so I could truly talk to you on the spirit box. Maybe it is just interacting, because it could be right here, and it's interacting with this. But I, no fingerprints. And guess what, it couldn't be anyway, so definitely no fingerprints. Or UV. Now I don't think this is a shade. It's just, oh, my inventory. See, I, I have such a hard time keeping, keeping track of my inventory when I have a lighter in there. I don't know why. Maybe I'll f eventually learn it. Are you here? Please don't ear blast me. Are you friendly? Are you here? Are you away? Are you close? I mean, you definitely roam me. What if I like... How would I know if you were in here? I'm gonna assume you're just nearby. I know if I have the light on, it's pointless. I'm gonna hope you're nearby. Okay, well there goes all the lights. Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you close? Are you here? Are you friendly? I think even if the breaker's off, you still have to have the light switches off. So I'm turning the breaker back on. Okay, you're in your room. Are you here? Are you friendly? <laughs> yes! I knew you were a damn spirit box ghost! Mirror spirit Moroy Dio. Dio again on Tanglewood. Are you here? Okay, are you here? Are you friendly? Give us a sign. Damn, only one response. I want to turn the light on now. Because we haven't seen dots. So then... Could this be a Dio? Wow, it really could be a lot of these things. So, I know I said I wanted to have this... Dots go back and forth. But what I'm gonna do... I really should set it up like... I gotta go up there? Oh my god, is that gonna be nice? This is still gonna get blocked by this. Like, what am I doing here? Set it up here. And just let it... Okay, yeah, I hear you. I'm gonna go get the other dots. Okay, and maybe some crucifixes. Okay, please don't trap me and hunt me right now. Sanity is probably gone. So... We don't need a photo of the ghost, so once again, I'm probably not even going to use the summoning circle. I'm just going to battle this ghost like normal. Well, actually, I, I might need to light some of those candles. I need two more photos. So what do I do? Since I can drain my sanity, let's go full sanity and do two photos. And then try and... Like... <laughs> maybe it's dots. If it's a Dio, it would be dots. I don't think it's going to be freezing. Well, <laughs> see, I'm used to playing professional. But it doesn't even matter. Oh! Okay, then we have our two. See, I'm I'm instilling the professional mindset. Okay, see, this is why I come back to the truck to regroup. See, nightmare mode. Then we have the two. But I'm feeling like it's a Dio for some reason. But I don't think any of these would have... I think Moroi would be the guaranteed spirit box. See, now I'm back in the nightmare mindset. 
The, but the Moroi is the curses, so I think the Moroi always has spirit box. And see, now my sanity. I mean, I could like sit here and say my sanity goes below 25, but now my guess is Moroi because Moroi always has spirit box. Now, it didn't turn on any lights, and it's it's not really been throwing stuff. It's been touching doors. Well, okay. I'm glad I realized I'm looking for an invisible third evidence. So then, yeah, it, might, it looks like it's going to be hunt time. Okay, I'm not even going in. I didn't take any evidence. I totally was on the wrong page here. I was thinking this was a professional. But I'm going to get a crucifix in here for, I guess, a little extra time. My voice is starting to go out. Okay, I'm going to get this salt down. I do have two salt. Well, three. <laughs> one, one. Yeah, see, it's so weird. I have three things. I always think I have two. There we go. Now... All I wanted was this. Please. The Serb Salt. All three star. We got everything. <laughs> I'm just going to the basement. Oh, it was... <sighs> I'm so... Because all of a sudden here, like, I really was just in professional mindset. So if this is a Dio, thank you for that. I, uh, maybe it's a mare. We really just need to get hunted to find out. It hasn't turned on any lights, I don't think, so I actually feel like it's a mare. But now it just comes down to surviving. So I'm gonna turn off my headlight. I'm gonna turn on some lights in the building. <gasps> Holy shit, dude! <laughs> what are the odds of that happening? I don't know how ghost events work, but dude, how do they teleport right in front of me? I don't want to smudge them just yet. So you turned off this light. If it's a Dio, it's going to be easy. Moroi, like, I can't tell if it... Because I would have, <laughs> I'd have to have the sanity meter to see how fast my sanity is draining. But we got the spirit box, we got ghost writing. See, I probably didn't even need the crucifix. I don't think it's a poltergeist. And of course, spirit would be the three minute thing. I mean, it's been throwing stuff, but we'll tell from a hunt. So from a hunt, we can definitely tell poltergeist or Dio. Now... These other ones are going to be, like, impossible to test other than the spirit. Where should I leave this if I'm going to... If I get stuck, I'm going to want a crucifix here. Not a crucifix, but a smudge. I think I have... It's hard to tell. I have two smudges on me. Because there, I could get dead-ended by a Dio here. See, I wanted to get rid of that, but you did it for me. Okay, turning back on the lights again. This time, all of them are used up. All the crucifixes. So if this, I mean, it, yeah, it's throwing a lot. So it could be a pulty. I saw that before. Oh my god. I, he's there. I wonder what the cooldown is on this crucifix, because he's probably about to hunt. So what I'm going to do, head in here. What do I do? <laughs> I have two smudges. I could smudge in here. Okay, let's see if he's a Dio. I should have just hid. I wonder if I can get in my hiding spot still. I'm listening. It's not a Dio. I need to hear it throwing a lot. Nah. It's throwing nothing. It threw one thing. Okay, well, I, I haven't smudged it. Okay, I'm going to smudge in its room. It was 1545. So, in three minutes, if it smudges, or if it hunts before three minutes, we know it's a Mare Moroi. Now that, of course, uses one of my smudges, and I need to go pick up my other one, because I'm not, I don't want to be without it. And also, I'm just still running. This game went from like, come on, what? I was like kind of enjoying this game and then now it's like, I'm super stressed out. Breaker on, was that a poltergeist ability? I think it was, no, a poltergeist ability would have been way more than that. That's the sound of like one plate hitting the floor. I really need to hide. I mean, hiding in there is a good spot to hide to listen for poltergeist stuff. Mm -mm. I mean, every time I've, ha I've been against a poltergeist, though, I've been hearing that ability, so I don't think it's a poltergeist ability. 
Okay, we're coming up on 1645. Okay, I guess I'm gonna spend some time here. And I'll be back if it hunts. I was looking out the window here, it's that chair. I was wondering if somehow a mannequin got out there. But I'm leaving this ghost be. I was really kind of open for another deal, but actually, you know I wasn't, because I'm sick of deals, aren't I? I don't know where that was. But for a poltergeist, I would have heard a poltergeist ability. Especially with on you know being a small map, I would have at least heard it. Because I've heard I've heard holy shit, dude. I've heard pretty much everything that's happened. I'm, dude, this is such crazy ghost events for this game. I've never had ghost events that feel like this. And also, you're breaking out these lights. Maybe you're a mayor. I bet you're a mayor. That's two light breaks, and you've not been turning on lights. That's going to be my guess, then. You're eventing in every room you can. Turning off lights. Uh Hiding in the basement again. See, he's... Mm. That's a that's a poltergeist repeated throw. It's a poltergeist. A poltergeist. A poltergeist is the only ghost that can throw something immediately again. And I heard it just like machine gun throwing. So I'm gonna say my guess is poltergeist. But it's weird because we never heard an ability. But maybe we did, and I just didn't notice it. I've been talking a lot, and I usually talk over anything. Well, we don't know if this is gonna be a perfect game or not. But I'm gonna go ahead and call it. Got all the objectives, got photos, and I'm go. I, I, for once, I have to play this game and be like, this is what I think I heard. So I'm gonna go for it. And if if a non poltergeist ghost can throw that much, at least I will have learned. I really do just want to get out of here though, because I think I know what the ghost is. Let's just try and see if I'm right. And it wasn't it wasn't Goodbye. even close to what I thought. Well, at least I know it can kind of repeatedly throw something, but uh, it kind of did sound like a poltergeist, but in the other hunts it didn't, so I guess you've really got to have multiple things, but well, at least I got enough for a level, like a pity level, and again, I didn't die, so, but that's the thing about nightmares, you can be wrong, so like this professional game went to nightmare because I've just been in professional. I was ready to do the weekly, but then I was just like, screw this week's weekly, but what about those abilities? One. So maybe that one time I thought I heard it, I did. But otherwise, still. I, that's what I wanted to do that, though. I thought I heard Pol Poltergeist, so I'm still learning stuff here. So if you're still here, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.